All right, because I also remember when I started, I st my first gig wasn't even related to Forex itself. It was actually a transcribing job. A transcribing job. So transcribing is you, you listen to audio audio files and then you type it out into text for the client. It's actually a stressful job, but it's actually worth it and well paying us also. Um, but that and so so for let's say when I tell them I'm talking about um, we we use a lot to fund the trading account. Those are some other some other side businesses you could do that could help to raise start you know start up um, from the beginning you know from scratch how to raise trading funds or even that might even be your major source of income. I don't know because right now we're talking about source of income you can get from knowledge of forex. But I wasn't talking about several businesses you can be doing side business you could be do that actually could help fund your trading account as well as other things in your other cost and fund your other bills in your life. So. So uh, you don't necessarily have to always start um, um, with uh, something related to Forex on Fiverr. Do even even though that's what the topic of this current um, um, category is, is about, you know. So just have an open mind and money is money, you understand. Know,